Hi, I'm Chris Allen from Subbyville, Delaware, and this is my 1967 full resto mod Camaro, and here we're here competing in the Grade 8 for the Riddler Award. The car is, uh, it's got a three, 355 small, small block, supercharged small block with methanol injection and a uh, 400 turbo automatic transmission. The, the theme behind the car is we were, we were trying not to build just another Camaro. We were trying to go out of the box, make something that was extremely elegant, um, but retain the originality of the car. So uh, a lot of modifications, body, every, every body on the car has been um, smooth or modified or, or adjusted. And uh, all the, all the uh, a lot of machining work on this car, CNC work and, and a ton of plating as, as you can see. The interior in the car is a two-tone interior. It's uh, cedar on top with a harvest gold on the bottom. Uh, the, uh, we, it has uh, Dakota Digital uh, dash in it. The uh, paint on the car is a custom blend. It's sandstone gold on the top with lava rock on the bottom and with a pinstripe and the pinstripe is painted to uh, match the harvest gold of the interior to bring uh, a little bit of the inside of the car out. One of the neat features of the car and the custom machine work is Every single bolt on the car has been one-off made. Every stainless bolt has been one-off made and, uh, and milled. As an example on, on these one-off made bolts, as you can see, the heads on the stainless bolts have all been milled. To carry out the theme on the bolts, we also um, CNC a, a center cap for the wheels that uh, has the same uh, uh, design as the bolt heads and also carry that theme as on the horn button on the steer, uh, steering wheel. And here's an example of the paint. It's two-tone with a pinstripe, the sandstone gold, the harvest gold, pinstripe, and the lava rock bottom color from the rocker down.